Alright guys, we're playing Village Feud. Now, best way to describe this game, it's like totally accurate battle simulator, but more of like a realistic, I guess you could say. Um, one thing I thought was funny, I want to do some option settings and they literally say, we don't actually have the option. <laughs> the button just looked nice. But we're going to do single player. We're going to put it on normal because we're men. Now there's no volume settings or anything, so I don't know how loud this shit's going to be, but we'll, we'll, we'll do our best. Oh, there's a house. Let's go see. I mean, controls would have been nice. I like how it's just kind of figure it out on your own. Press E. House. Market wall, 30 gold. Armory. Uh, upgrade that. Ching. Upgraded. Hey, what up? Okay, so I understand how this works. Gotta wait nine more seconds. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Hello. What up, my dude? So basically, we're creating a village here. Uncle Ten gold. Where are you paying me? Where are you paying? So right me? now I'm recruiting an. Oh my god, that's a lot more than I expected. Worker. Okay, we don't really need any more workers, but what I would like is a wall. Ching. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're slowly building. So now I get two gold per second. I understand. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, just died. What? Are you guys fighting each other? What? These guys are idiots. Ka ching Ka ching Where's the market? What up? Press e. for you. Health, bow, armor level one. Okay, I see how this works. Now, how do I... I have to look up... Jeez, calm down. Some, well, someone actually hit me there. Let's see, what else can we build? Upgrade. Ching. Let's upgrade. Nice. Now, can you guys stop attacking me, or could I actually use my weapon? Because using a weapon would be really nice if I could figure out how the hell to do it. I'm also down three lives apparently, and my house is about to be destroyed. Okay, let, let's let's try this again. Single player, easy. We're gonna go easy just so we can figure this shit out. Okay, so let's go armory. Okay, no, let's start with the Ching. wall. We want... ka -ching. Yes. Okay, now... I will do as instructed. Two gold. Perfect. We're not even going to bother with an armory yet. Who are you? Wall archer, fort archer... Yeah, Protecting sure. Protecting the village. <laughs> the voice acting is impeccable. B oh, wait. We're close. So we want to get as much gold as possible. I will do as oh god, I see him coming. Can we upgrade the wall? Upgrade wall, Maria. Okay, so there's apparently no attack button, which is amazing. So yes, your honest. Yeah, this ought to be good. We're gonna build the armory real Ching. fast. Like super fast because we're about to lose a lot of people. Okay. All right, man. Paying me. Get in there. It's time for a war. I like how they just casually walk in. Like they don't, they don't give a shit. So now we just have to wait a little bit. Let's get the market Ching. going, which works pretty well. Get your bow here. Increase your health by one. Okay. Right now, I think we're okay. My men don't seem to be stopping. They see it. Honest to God, they're pushed all the way through. Let's upgrade Ching. the armory. Why not? So now we can unlock archers. We go get some archers. We'll get some halberds. I don't even know what those are. Oh, I can even I can upgrade my gold even more. Oh my goodness. Now, I'm not going to right now though because we got to we got to do some stuff. 
So I need to get my city hall to level two before I can upgrade my wall. I understand. So basically it's about making cash money. So actually what I'm gonna do, ready, hear me out. We're gonna save up five, ooh, 500 gold is actually gonna take a while. So I lied. I will do See what goes. I wanna do is I wanna get this as high as I can so I can buy the mine and the mine increases gold output by 40%. So that means it's either gonna give me 40% more gold each time or it's gonna boost the amount of time it takes for me to get gold, which would be absolutely insane because it's already <laughs> five a second. So we're just gonna keep basically plowing through just just adding gold to our yes your honor. thing so now we're at six six a second oh my guys i'm so look at this i'm already a pro player i don't i don't get it i'll get them. oh i put two, i put in too many oh oh the enemy's in here men attack men attack it's only one it's only one yeah you better run bitch you better run so I have to, oh, I just realized we, okay. So we have to get our city hall up, which is because we have to get, so there's certain things that you have to have. So city hall level three for a mine. So we're not getting the mine for a while, but we can definitely get a city hall. Cause that way we can make other upgrades. City hall upgrade. Ka-ching. Ka -ching. And now that should allow me to purchase some stuff I'm at City Hall level what what am I at right now we can upgrade our wall hey let's see let's upgrade the wall Ching. don't really know what changed not much we can upgrade the wall Ching. twice which is not a bad idea so now we have little towers but now we can do the mine armory should we upgrade the armory yet probably not Gain spots to recruit workers for Ching. the house. Nice. So now we have three. Oh my god, guys. We're about to go in deep. My men are fighting out there. So we're actually going to make a crap ton more peasants. Market level Ching. two. Two markets now. What do we got? Um, craft that. Feel free to look around. Ooh, okay. I see how it works. Nice. Get in there, men! Oh my god, look at my army. Ka ching Okay, cool. Press 2 to equip. Oh! I like how literally all I have to do is swarm them. With the uh, with guy. It's, it's not even a fight, honestly. Keep mushing. Look, and my army's still coming. They couldn't even get through the first wave. Upgrade. So gold output is basically insane right now. Now, can I do anything with the farm, or is it literally just for gold output? So now I'm at 12 gold. This is good. This is really good. You know what? Let's, let's put the money in. Why not? Let's put some money in. What do we got to buy? Let's throw some knights in there. Let's, oh my god, get in there, boys. That's an uh, indestructible army right there. 120 for a battle Ching. axe. Three to equip. Oh my god. Ching. Level two armor. Is that the attack? That That's the attack? Dear god. Man, if they... Real talk, real talk. Ready? Right? Like, sidebar... If they made a game like this that was not like an indie game, like a triple A game, I would play this all the time. I, I love games like this, and people don't make them enough. Okay, back to game. Long shot. Oh, imagine if I hit something there. <laughs> so, yeah, it seems like our next goal is just to get to a 1,000. So, that might take a little bit. We'll cut that out. Oh, we won. Oh, I kind of wanted to... I mean, I'm just so good at the game, I can't even finish, dude. I mean... I guess you would do like a... I think this game's made more so for multiplayer aspect. Like, single player, obviously, too easy, but... Uh, I'll end it there. It's actually really interesting. Now, I don't... I'm not going to... 
I, I won't lie to you. It's not a game that I would spend money on. It feels more like a free game, even though I did spend the money. Um, I did so you guys didn't have to. Um, I think that this game is a good catalyst for more, like a bigger company to do, like a better idea. So thank you to the indie creators for making that. And hopefully this gets big so that someone sees it. But uh, yeah, it's, it's fun. So if you do want to try it out, as always, I'll leave a link in the description for those of you that want to try it out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. So peace, peace.